God, Silvio. Papa's got a brand new bed. Oh, Silvio, she cleaned up really well, buddy. I had to do a little toothbrush trick. You're going to see a little bit of uh, areas that are still drying. That's not water. That's actually like a Windex type solution that will flash off. Um, couldn't get everything. Just decades of wear. And um, was very gen very gentle around uh, the vent, which is already uh, cracking a bit. But that would not be too hard to replace. Um, so let me get you hooked up for a sound sample. Bye. All right, Silvio. I know you're still working, but I couldn't help myself. So got to put back together, cleaned up. She looks really good. So it's on the ultra setting, going through a 412. So this guitar will not stay in tune. It's got some new strings on. Um, I actually hadn't changed the strings for about two years since I, I had that really horrific accident with my uh, left fret hands index finger. So let's see how well she holds together. Obviously forgot how to play music, but this is a good little sample. Let's see what the clean channel has to offer. finger can't anchor it anywhere channel that I can't access without a foot switch and actually I have the foot switch um, in storage I need to pop that thing out but wow man what a great sound let's go back to the lead channel actually uh, the crunch would be uh, with the ultra gain deselected I believe let's try it out <laughs> thing about the teal amps the teal stripes is the voicing options like the edge body and bottom just put the mids and the highs and lows exactly where you need them love it so much <laughs>
sure how much lower gain that was. But let's take it down. <laughs> These, the Rock Masters, you can't lose, man. Just go grab a Teal Stripe. It doesn't matter if it's solid state or not. Go get one.